you guys welcome to my channel guys i'm about to do a story time about friends that are fake friends guys i want you to first i want you to like share and subscribe about a story time that i experienced with friends you know sometimes you have friends and you think that they are with you and everything you do for that person and when you when it comes to the end of the day the person only wants to use you take this advantage of situations and always pretending so I had this girl thought that she was a friend and she pretends around me and I just didn't pick it up because I was just this genuine person, loving person, always giving. And I can't remember she wasn't working but I was working and I asked a friend of mine to ask the boss to give her a job and she called me and she said you don't talk to them for me man and I said I'm going to ask her man don't worry because she wasn't working and I want her to get a job and I I tell my friend just to lie to say yes you know her you know her but my friend didn't know her because my friend is working at that place for years and I said to her, just if the boss asks you, just tell her that you know her. Right? And when you when she when I said to her, when you come, just ask for her. Don't ask for me. Ask for her. And give her the letter. And that's what she did. About a month after they called her and tell her to come in for an interview. And she came in. She came in to get the position of her um, office helper. She did that and then it was for two weeks and then the two weeks finished and they called my friend asked her what kind of person she is, how long she knew her and everything she said was a lie because she didn't know her. She did not know her but because I wanted her to get the job. I just tell my friend to just say yes you know her a few much years and whatever. Anyway, she come in and she was working in my department and she was there working. I can remember the, when it, it, she came in about, uh, I think it was in November, I think so, yeah, of 2018, she came in the November. When she came in the November, now there was going to be a, a a Christmas party no no she didn't come in there she came in before she came in before and she was there talking and said my glad you get you and all of that and and stuff like that after a while my mother says it changed completely she not talk to me when we even call to her she don't want to answer she start move, she start move different so my girlfriend said to me now, say, oh, your friend I moved, so like, so I said, I look on it and I don't know what is happening. So anyway, that's one day, me and my friend was walking and she joined me. Because she didn't know how to use the machine, the money machine. So I said, come on, we'll show you. And then you can learn from after that. And when I was walking down, she said, she passed her remarks and said, yeah, take me away from my friend. That is the girl that she don't know. I said, what kind of stupidness that she said and you don't know her? It's here you come and meet her. So she said, never can you get the work for me now. You want me to come bow down on your foot and this. And she started carrying on and carrying on and going. I mean, you know, person just changed my mind from this whole lot of friend thing and she started going and start going and 
when the Christmas come for the party now, and I was there planning, I'm the person who planned the party, and I planned the party and I collected money and exchanged the gifts and all that. I'm going to tell her before all of the arguments, you know, that there's going to be a party and whatever exchange I give and whose name she get and stuff like that. The girl switch on me and start at different. She goes to the boss and tell the boss, oh, me don't want her at the party. Me not invite her. The boss call my friend and tell my friend, say, oh, come, me not invite she at the party. So I said, what a girl like? So I was about to go to the boss. Uh, so my friend told me and said, no, nobody go because she don't want to argue me. I said, the girl too lying, man. I was about to go, you know, and just melt it all out, you know. Eventually, still, me just hold it down. So she, she everybody was supposed to pay a thousand dollars so that they can get um, cake chicken every little thing she go and she give another person the money so the person called me and say i know you forget the money so i said yeah she said so why should bring come give me she said i really don't know you know so she take the money and give it to the guy and the guy took it and we said okay better you take it and put and buy whatever you want to buy with it because this is not a friend. This is not a friend. Anyway, she start going and carry on and we can talk to her again. And eventually we just start don't deal with her period. We not deal with her none at all. I'm say no. That is why I try my best to stay away from these fake friends who say they are with you because when I was down you know and, and 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 going through she was there so you know i used to think that she was a friend but you see when she get up and feel so she on top the girl turn against me start carrying my name to the boss people see her in her office and gossip with boss no she carrying lots of news so she carried news on the supervisor and she and the supervisor fall out eventually they were the corona come now so they start issue out letters and stuff like that the whole fuck up and um seems to be on must be on layoff and stuff so she did get the letter she called and said she wants she don't have no money and whatever, whatever. Anyway, they take her back. But as for me, they said that I am this and I am that and whatever. But a lot of things that I keep in, I keep in it because I know at the end of the day, one of these days, God is going to reveal the truth. So I don't have to rush into man and say, oh, and say yes and try to convince. No, God will reveal the truth soon about everything. And when you try to do good, that's why you always get somebody always try to put you down so that is the, the, the reason why i don't want persons that are fake around me so i kind of push back myself i don't try to get too close to people i just try to keep myself a little distance away because getting people to come into your circle it is a whole lot of different ball game. Because when they start getting close, they start to carry on and behave in a different way. So I try. So that is the reason why sometimes I pull away from people. Because she was fake and she pretend to be good and to be nice and to be sympathetic and all of that. And she wasn't genuine. So some of the reasons you just have to leave some people and just go on by yourself. So I'm just saying that people come around and pretend to be who they are not and when you check it out you find out that boy she was not a good person so that was that had with that person so no I don't know anything that is going on with her I leave her alone and I just do my thing and I just um, carry on and still doing good still I'm um, encouraging people still looking out for people so that is the reason why sometimes you have to 
so you can find out who is who before you really get the person close to you so guys i want you to subscribe and like this video i'm out